So an implant, as people call it, has three parts to it. There's the titanium tube, the implant itself, which is a precisely engineered and um, specially coated sterile titanium tube that replaces the root of the tube. That requires a small surgical procedure to place the implant into the bone in the correct position and it takes time for the implant to fuse with the bone. Now the success rate of that is, is very high in the right people. So that's uh, non-smokers, non-diabetics, a few other implications as well, indications. Once the, so it takes, takes three to six months for the implant to fuse depending on the site. Once it has fused, then we can use it to secure in the case of a single tooth, a crown. Now, a crown is a bit of the tooth that we see and we make the crown look just like the teeth next door, so it's not noticeable. And that is attached to the implant by something that you might have heard called the abutment. So the abutment's a customised uh, attachment that links the implant to the crown and allows us to make the crown absolutely rock solid secure. In cases where we're doing more than one teeth, again, there's multiple implants in this case, uh, and there's multiple abutments, and then we're attaching either sometimes still a very compact removable denture um, or a fixed bridge that uh, can only be removed by the dentist. And there's pros and cons of each of these and when we see you for a consultation then we will go through these things with you.